thanks to AtomicBeats.com. The death toll rose in Haiti on Thursday as rescue teams were able to begin reaching more remote areas that had been cut off when Hurricane Matthew struck down on the country's southwest peninsula. Matthew was the first Category 4 storm to hit the country in more than half a century. As waters began receding, bodies started to appear on the shore. According to the Civil Protection Agency, at least 122 people have died in Haiti. Authorities expect the number will continue to rise. Hey, what's up everybody? It's OC again. Uh, here we are on Friday morning. As you can see, there's a lot of branches and stuff on the ground, but nothing really major yet. I don't think we're going to get anything major. Uh, just some water. Good thing we got the sandbags there. Some branches are holding, the big branches up top there, they're holding pretty good. Let's look out here in the road. <laughs> this is what we got in my neighborhood. A couple down branches here. The uh, bamboo. branches laying around on the road. <laughs> that is one thing. The roads are still empty. No one out and about anywhere. Yet. Alright, let's see here. <laughs> Simba's going back inside. He came out for a little bit this morning. Let's see the backyard here. Oh man. I don't know how this missed the house. Oof. Goodness. Wow. Well. well. I'm going back in. To the comfort of the house. As you can see. The wind is still kicking pretty good here. And uh. The storm is not done with us yet, so uh, we'll see how things go from here. Going inside, Simba. All right. If you hear it, listen well. You're just one of the few. I don't normally open up, it's rarely seen to you. I gotta tell my story, I gotta tell the truth. I made a promise to my mama, I'ma see it through. Standing. out. As hundreds of thousands of people try to get out of harm's way, I'll speak with somebody who's flat out refusing to leave, and I'll ask her why she's staying, and if she expects us to cover her funeral. <laughs> 